Hi guys, welcome to today's video. Um, I just wanted to say sorry, I have not posted any videos. I have been sick for the past two weeks. I don't know what it is. I've just like lost my voice like every day. It's really weird. And then I've had like really bad migraine. Now I am back and I'm going to do a review on Aspen Ovard's um, collab with Pixie. And I got the glowy highlighter in London Luster. And then I also got the brow tamer or the clear brow gel. I was going to get the one, um, her other one that came with the brow gel and the liner, but I already have eyeliner and I don't really use eyeliner anymore, so I just decided to just buy the brow gel by itself and it also saved money. This is just going to be a little get ready with me and we're just going to try these so out. First, I'm going to start with my Too Faced Hangover FX um, primer. I am almost done with it. I'm so happy because I do not like this as much as I thought I would. Um, I only got it because Cass, blah, 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 blah. I only got it because Kathleen Lights um, suggested it because she loves it and she has dry skin, as do I. So I was like, why not try it out? She knows best. But that was not the case this time. I just. It does not smell like coconuts, so that's good, and I really hate coconuts, like the smell of coconuts and the taste of coconuts, so for those of you who do not like coconuts but like have dry skin and want to try this out, go ahead. You do not smell coconuts at all, thank the lord. Um, see, look how my skin gets red every time I put moisturizer on. I don't know what it is. Um, but yeah, this stuff is okay, but... The reason why I don't like it and why I will not be repurchasing it is because on my T-zone it makes it real greasy and sticky. Um, I don't know why. I'm still trying to figure out my skin type and like how to take care of it because now that I am an adult I need to start taking care of my skin or else I will have really bad skin when I'm older. And then yeah see I don't like the way this feels. It's like really sticky. I'm using my viewfinder by the way. So, yeah, I don't like that. So, I'm, now I'm using the Pixie Brow Gel. And I, I'm really excited to use this because I really do need a brow gel. I've never had, well, I've had one, but I've never, like, known how to use it for some reason. Um, but this, now that I'm, like, trying to get into makeup more, just to boost my confidence lately because I've just been really depressed and not happy with myself. Um, yeah. So I'm really excited to see how this turns out. I think this is how you use it. <laughs> Help me, guys. You think with all the beauty girls that I follow, I would know how to use everything? <laughs> but I don't. I actually need to go get my eyebrows um, waxed. This has been my favorite for the past... When did I get this? I got this in January. For the past two months, it's the Papa Don't Peach blush. So I don't know if I should mix them or what. Peach smells, I do not like. I do not like artificial smells at all. So like... But this smells fine. It smells like... The, you know, um, I'm going to put a picture somewhere. It's like these sour gummy rings. I don't know what they're called. They're the peach ones. Whatever, it'll be up here. But it smells so good. So, yeah, I'm just going to... I don't know, because I don't know how much... How glowy this is. We're going to use that as a topper. I learned that from... Who, who did I learn that from? Oh, what is her name? I'm going to use the Morphe R38. This is pretty soft, but I don't really like this white hair. I don't. I normally do not like this hair because it hurts my eyes. My skin is so sensitive. So I'm just gonna swirl it around. Just top it right over that acne. using my trusty Morphe um, 334. If you guys 
If there is one brush you get from Morphe, it is this one. I love this so much. I use it to like blend out my eyeshadow a lot, to like finish blending, and I use it to finish blending. Like basically, I use it to finish blending everything to make sure it's all blended perfectly, because it's just it's perfect for the last um, blend, as you can see in my videos. You know what I mean? Yeah. You see that? You see that? Highlight my nose or my cubes bow or any corner of my eyes. What am I doing? I'm failing. I'm sorry. So, I'm gonna highlight that. Learn from Jeffree Star. So, my final thoughts on the uh, Pixie slash Esmeralvard um, highlighter in London Luster. Mm, it's not enough for me. I thought it would be a lot brighter, but it's really not. It's like too white. It's too white for me. I thought, uh, you can see a little bit. Um, yeah, I'm definitely going to do a topper with this because it's not enough. So, Holy Grail, which is Lunch Money by Colourpop. I don't know how I barely hit pan. Like, I use this so much and I barely hit pan. So that's good. Um, so let's add some more highlight. and see what that looks like. There we go. Yep, that's all I needed. All I needed was um, a lunch money. My lunch money highlight. Like I said, this is really good. <laughs> really? This is good, but I will need a topper. If you're like me and you want it to show, to actually show and be bright and like not having to do a lot of work, just be like, it's good for the nose highlight. I like that a lot. But yeah, this is definitely a good base highlighter and I'm, I'm definitely going to keep trying this and let you guys know at the end. Why do I keep dropping this? I will let you guys know how it is at like maybe in my favorites video. I'm gonna start doing those, doing those again. Is it worth fifteen dollars? No, no. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. This was this was eight dollars. Okay. How much of a difference it makes? And this is fifteen dollars. I'm kind of disappointed because this is my first Pixie product. Because of her, I wanted to try Pixie, but now I don't know. I'm just giving you guys my honest opinion, my honest view. Of the product I love it my eyebrows eyebrow hair is staying in place this is probably going to be fun. so yeah that is all for this get ready with me video I hope you guys enjoyed don't forget to subscribe down below notified when I upload more videos and comment down below if you guys have ever tried pixie what if you have what products do you actually like um, and if you have tried Aspen's highlighter and if I should try another one. So yeah, I will see you guys later. And yeah, thank you for watching. Bye.